Hello my beautiful people, how are we today? Today we're going to try out the uh, Revlon Colorstay Skin Awakening Caffeine and Vitamin C 5-in-1 Concealer, 24-hour wear. Come on. Come on. Come on. <sighs> okay, here comes a puppy. He wants to say hi. <laughs> okay. I need to take a deep breath because I just ran up the stairs. I went to go close the door because it's about to rain out here in Colorado. Okay? We're about to get soaking wet. So on Ulta's website, the Revlon Color State Concealer uh, has one, two, three, four, five, six. Only has six shades. Oh, this is not the one that I want. Mm -mm. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. Okay, here we go. We have the right one. We have the right one, honey. Okay, Revlon Color State Skin Awakening Concealer. Oh, they still don't have... Oh, they have a ton of shades. Okay, cute. It's $12.89 at Ulta. Summary, Revlon Color Stay Skin Awakening, Skin Awaken 5-in-1 Concealer erases, perfects, brightens, hydrates, and refreshes skin for a flawlessly awake look for up to 24 hours. Details, awake look. Oh, no, I'm sorry. Benefits, awake look, 24-hour wear, 5-in-1 multitasking concealer, ultra lightweight, comfortable feel, transfer resistant, buildable natural coverage, erases, perfects, brightens, hydrates, refreshes, caffeine and vitamin C infuse, hide imperfection in dark circles, brighten skin, and camouflage puffiness. Yes, God! Features, mess-free antibacterial sponge tip. I hate a sponge tip. We'll just say that right now. Helps prevent the buildup of bacteria. Free from added parabens, yada, yada, yada. 19 natural finishes, finish shades. How to use. Using the mess-free antibacterial sponge tip applicator, dab on the multitasking, long-wearing concealer. Dot concealer onto dark circles, starting under the inner corners of your eye. Blend out lightly with your finger, your ring finger. Avoid using your pointer because it's easy to apply too much pressure and smear the concealer. Apply in a gentle padding motion. Build until you have desired coverage. Now move on to any imperfections and dark spots and just dot and gently blend. Okay, we're going to use our brush just like we usually do. Okay, and so this is the packaging. If I can get it to focus. Okay. Q, I like the squeezy tube, but I do not like this puffy thing. Uh, what shade did I get? I got 050 medium deep. Uh, so we're just going to squeeze it. I'm assuming some comes out. Oh, yeah, it's coming out. It's getting saturated. Okay, I don't know why I'm whispering. Might be just a little bit dark, but we're gonna try it out. I hate these sponge tips, but at least this one's smaller than the the Maybelline Instant Rewind. That one was a hot mess. Okay, we're just gonna go ahead and dab a little bit under the eye here. See, it's so hard to control the product. I think that's enough. I got a bunch on my desk. Okay, let's go ahead and blend, blend her. We're going to blend her. See, it looks a lot lighter than in the tube, right? Mm. Girl, I don't know about this. Mm. It is not looking good. Okay, let's see if the camera can pick it up. This is the done side, and this is the undone side. Can you see? Cakey? I don't think it's just, it's not my day, because I tried the camo concealer the elf camo concealer before this and i was like no i'm not leaving the house like this and i might have the same situation but i have to leave in about 10 minutes to get to a meeting so this might have to do but it looks cakey crunchy and it is collecting on the inner corner mm -mm. no ma'am okay let me just try it on the other side and just see if we can get a little bit better blend okay we're just gonna do a little bit here here my dog's trying to get comfortable okay let's try to Press this in and get a better blend. Okay, well that side was just a little bit better, I think. I have a little bit higher hope for it. This side just looks terrible, but this side looks a little better. Like a little bit better. It's not, it's still not great. It's still not great. Let's see about the blushes. I don't know how I feel about it. What do you guys think? Can you even see? So this is a completed look. It's not really covering. I mean, I know this is a behemoth of a... A blush here but that's not really doing much to cover it I'm just I don't 
I don't know if I'm vibing on this. I feel like it kind of covered my dark circles, but it's getting like a little, it's getting kind of like all over the place. Yeah, it's getting on my upper lid. I just, I don't know. I don't know about this. It's kind of working, but it's kind of not working. Like, I just expect more from my concealer than this is what this is offering me. But this is just not it for me. I don't think it's just like not blending well. I don't think it's it. Nope. All right, this is out in the field, Colin, and um, I have to retract a little bit on what I said. It's not terrible. I look very sweaty right now. It's raining outside, so it's getting rained on. I'm hangry, so I'm having a snack, but I don't hate it. It does collect a little bit. I swear it's running in here. It does collect a little bit on the inner corner, but it does smooth out the under eye, kind of. So, okay, I maybe was a little bit too harsh on it before. I still don't love it but it's not the worst thing that I've ever put on my face. <laughs> anyway, I just wanted to shoot a little bit of an update while I was like out and about because I kind of like tore it to shreds. And this is kind of my updated feeling. Thank you so much for joining me on this review. I'm sorry, it's not a home run. We need a home run. We're gonna get one soon, I promise. Uh, thank you so much for joining me on this review. If you need any real estate help in the Denver metro area or in Colorado, I am your man. I can help you with apartment leasing. I can help you with buying. I can help you with selling. All of my contact information will be down below. Please feel free to reach out. Thank you so much for joining me on this review and I will check you on the next one. <laughs> Bye.